Well, back in 1950, 83% of us turned out to vote. That had dropped to 65% by the time of the last election in 2010. And in the Birmingham ward of Ladywood, it was less than half. So what will happen this year? Sarah Falkland has been to Ladywood to find out what issues are important to people there and how much appetite there is for this year's election. Inner city Birmingham, multicultural Britain. The Ladywood ward encompasses the city centre, the Jewellery Quarter, Soho and Edgbaston Reservoir. The faces here reflect the entire world. But when it comes to politics, it seems there's just one colour. Labour have won here since 1945, taking over 50% of the vote at each election. Anything can happen in an election. In this case, however, you could say with great certainty that it is going to stay Labour. It is the 428th safest seat in the country. But people we spoke to weren't so sure about Labour, or indeed the election. When Cameron, what he'd done to the working class people, Ed Miliver never stood up one day and said, what you're doing is wrong. So would you have normally voted Labour then? I would. I've always voted Labour. Yeah, I will vote, but I'm not sure who for yet. Yes, but I'm not sure who for yet. At the moment, I'm unsure if it's going to be Labour or the Conservatives. At the last election, Lady Wood had the third lowest turnout in the UK, just 48%. Are you going to vote in the forthcoming election? Uh, I don't think so, no. Why? Because I just feel they tell you one thing and then when they get into power they do the exact opposite. So. But women died for the vote. I know, I know. My friend was telling me that the other, <laughs> the other week. She was saying the same thing. Well, this is a constituency with a very uh, high unemployment rate. It's been one of the constituencies hit hardest by the effects of the austerity cuts and by the effects of the recession. And it's perhaps not surprising that in that context, you find that the electorate is distrustful of politicians. So what do people care enough about, enough to get them to the ballot box? Immigration, um, uh, namely, I am voting for the party that has its best policy regarding how to control it. The health service is my biggest one, and immigration. Schooling, housing, um, just all different things, immigration really as well. Ladywood has the youngest population in the West Midlands. May the 7th will be the first chance that some of them have to say who they want running the country. Sarah Falkland, BBC Midlands Today in Birmingham. It's coming up to a quarter to seven. This is our